uh, to the continue uh, videos uh, for this uh, doing math with uh, Python. So if you uh, watch my earlier videos, uh, congratulations, you have finished the first uh, four chapter completely. Uh, and if you like my video series, uh, I will welcome you to follow my channel so that you can get notification for the new videos. And also, I would like to hear your suggestions and comments to any of my videos so, uh, in order to make myself is, uh, uh, generate uh, new videos uh, with a better uh, way. Uh, so for this chapter, uh, we are going to talk about the sets and the uh, probability. So that is a uh, new uh, areas uh, within mass, uh, and we will discuss uh, how we use uh, Python to deal with those. Uh, so here, uh, let's uh, jump to the uh, of uh, uh, this uh, mind map. So within this uh, uh, chapter, only in two parts. Uh, uh, this part is the sets. Next part is the probability. Then we have a five uh, challenge uh, topic we will discuss. Uh, and within this video, I will talk about uh, first the two subparts uh, about the sets, uh, the definition, concepts, how to construct uh, our sets. Uh, and then this uh, talk about the sets relationship. So uh, we, uh, I put is, uh, some basic uh, uh, the, uh, the knowledge point here, uh, and we will go through that uh, uh, step by step uh, hands on uh, the practice altogether. Uh, so in short, uh, definition for sets is a collection of here is the keywords distinct object. So if you want to store a number one, 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 two. Then within the sets, is, uh, they don't uh, uh, store three, one, uh, number one, uh, but they just uh, store one because uh, uh, that's a three is not the distinct. Distinct is just the number one and number two. So in sets, it's a distinct object. Uh, and then the uh, often called is, uh, those objects uh, as uh, the element or members. Uh, so uh, there's a two major characters of a set. First is the well-defined, uh, which means is the uh, you may have always have a question: is uh, is a particular object in this collection or in this set? Always, if you define this as a set, uh, it must give you a clear yes or no uh, the answer. Uh, usually, it's based on the rule or some given criteria, but. That means uh, a set is a well-defined data structure. Second character is uh, no uh, two members uh, of a set are the same. So that refers to this uh, distinct. Uh, so, but in the other data uh, structure like list, tuple, dictionary, uh, they don't restrict you to store any uh, duplication or same elements uh, within one data structure. So that is the uh, the uh, two major character and uh, one more thing is uh, uh, a set you can uh, store almost everything or the anything I should say. So I uh, put this uh, as our linkage. Uh, so uh, this uh, back to the uh, of chapter two. So understanding the criteria of uh, this uh, uh, Cartesian uh, coordinate plan. So we will uh, also uh, later on to see is so we may have the Cartesian product uh, operator in the second part of this uh, chapter. So that you may see uh, there's a kind of the relationship between sites and uh, the some other mathematical concepts. Uh, so according for the sets, uh, when we move to the Python, uh, we have this uh, fine, uh, finite set uh, you need to import. Uh, then you can do something is uh, to constructing the set is to check whether the number is inside a set or not, create empty set, create a set from some existing uh, data sets or, for example, list or order, uh, and also set uh, the uh, configure the certain reputation and the order. So uh, those are the construction, uh, the sets we will learn. Second part is uh, we will learn the relationship uh, to talking about if you have two sets, 
uh, what are the subsets means, what are supersets means, what are the power sets means. So normally it's uh, here, is we don't have uh, the, uh, the space between that. And also we will introduce you how to uh, make the, uh, the lens of the sets, uh, which we call this uh, cardinality, uh, and also uh, what are the proper sets uh, means. So before we go to the book, uh, let's uh, uh, see some uh, the basic uh, the background. So set uh, is uh, part of the uh, the main pro, uh, main concept within the set theory. So uh, I would suggest is uh, you to either is uh, just uh, go through this uh, Wikipedia uh, the page, uh, uh, then you can find this uh, set series uh, his uh, history. Uh, and the modern study of this site is uh, initial by this uh, famous person, uh, German mathematician, uh, Richard uh, uh, uh And he uh, wrote a uh, very uh, big book uh, called his uh, essay of, uh, on the theory of number. So that is the origins uh, of the set theory. And now is, uh, you can find uh, is, uh, millions of uh, uh, the set theory related books. Uh, you can pick up or uh, anyone, uh, or you can uh, back to your, what you learned in your school so uh, to find this uh, set theory. So, uh, and then for the visualize of uh, some sites, I believe is uh, uh, in the primary school, uh, you already touch base on the sets. So starting from grade one. So when they learned the uh, natural uh, number, uh, that is a number uh, system, uh, then we know is a natural number is just uh, the integer number. So that means a natural number belong to or inside of integer number. So this is a subset uh, concept. Uh, so uh, then the integer is the uh, subset of a rational number. Rational numbers uh, is subset of real number. And the real number uh, and the imaginary number, uh, or we uh, see is a virtual uh, number, they are not have the uh, intersection, uh, and but both of them uh, comprise of the complex uh, the number uh, sets. So uh, in the number, uh, so that's also the Richard's uh, original book is the starting to talk about is uh, set series uh, uh, retrieve uh, uh, their own from the number uh, the uh, systems uh, discussion. So this is a uh, well uh, the, uh, and the simple uh, the illustration of the sets, uh, uh, the serious uh, sample. Uh, and then this, uh, uh, what's mean the subset? Subset is just uh, like a natural to uh, integer number. So if A is uh, inside B, so if both A and B are uh, the two sets, uh, and you can see A is uh, uh, inside B, so then we call A is a subset B and B is a superset A. Uh, but uh, and if A inside B and B has at least uh, any other element not belong to A, then we will later on to see that we will call the, uh, the proper subset and B is the proper superset. So that is the subset superset means. So uh, try to put this kind of uh, the picture in your mind. Uh, when they later on go to code. Uh, and the second one is the, the just the wise words. So when we know the subside, then you can see A is the superside, just the wise words. Uh, or we already can say B is the superside to A. Uh, and then the, uh, we have the power side, uh, the definition. So if we have a side one, two, three, power side is all the subsides uh, of this, uh, uh, the, uh, given uh, the set. Uh, so that it means uh, 1, 2, 1, 3, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, and even the empty side. So all of them are the subset on the different layer and uh, uh, combined uh, those uh, total seven uh, subsets, they are comprised with these uh, uh, the power sites uh, uh, of the one to three. So that is the some samples uh, in the visualized way. So let's uh, starting to uh, try some uh, uh, the ways uh, using the uh, the Python. Within this uh, first uh, sub chapter, I uh, 
on the definition, we don't need to have uh, any additional code. So uh, we, we, we already have the chapter five uh, empathy now, uh, but later on we will see is, uh, how we will uh, make the uh, the program. But for now, let's just use uh, Python terminal to do the uh, practice. So uh, starting from set construction, so what the library we need to load is uh, simpy import uh, finite infinite and this is finite so it means uh, they have the uh, uh, this uh, unknown scope so finite site both f and s are in capital uh, the letters so when you uh, load this uh, then we can start to uh, define the R set through this uh, method so o function finite set we see two four six then just using the parentheses. Then when you write down, uh, write S is in this uh, uh, the curly braces. Uh, it's a two four six. So that is the sets. And if I make this less C, so if I see two four six six uh, and I put S, it's a still two four six. So, so that uh, is that. Uh, distinct uh, value means so they ignore the repeatable value so they just uh, uh, store the distinct uh, values or distinct the object uh, into the set so uh, you define this as a three element this as four element but finally your sets are always a three distinct uh, element so that is the uh, initialize your sites or create uh, your sites and, and when you have uh, these uh, sites, uh, we can store the different type of numbers. Uh, so here is, uh, uh, it's not only the fraction, so, uh, fra uh, but from fractions, import fraction. So now is, uh, let's see, so we have uh, S here, and we do the fraction one five, and we can see it's, uh, 5.6. So now S is, uh, uh, we have divided this uh, 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 one uh, fifth. So that is first and two, four, 5.6 and six. Six is uh, merged uh, between these uh, two, uh, the count repeatable. So just the one distinct the six. And by default, they have this ordering from the lowest number to the highest number. But uh, let's see, so if I store our uh, ABC, so I store our the, uh, such kind of uh, the string. So you can see the string is also here, but the string is uh, after your number. So I suppose so they uh, build that is uh, if they know that, uh, uh, they will have uh, uh, the uh, the string after the number, uh, but may may not uh, strictly follow this ask uh, the uh, those code uh, code uh, tables uh, sequence. So, just uh, you can see if you know this uh, from the lower to higher, but there's not uh, fully the numbering uh, the ordering. No. And the cardinality uh, is the length. So if I put this uh, now. I have distinct uh, one, two, three, four, five, six number, uh, the elements. Now, if I put S, then I got six. So even if uh, I put seven, uh, when I define this uh, uh, finite set, uh, the cardinality is six, so distinct number. And check is uh, whether a number is in set. So just uh, what we put is uh, 5.6 in S, then I got true. But 5.7 in S, I got false. Uh, so uh, then that's the, uh, you can see here, did not evaluate a Boolean, so now, So did not evaluate, let's see. So standard in, I should get uh, false. So let, let's see, so four in S, true. 3 in S, I got uh, arrow. So uh, do I need to load any lines uh, to here? Didn't evaluate uh, to a uh, Boolean. Oh, let me have a check. 
I got this the uh, the possible reason is because I put the string inside uh, the set. So uh, I will put that is uh, three in. Uh, for example, is uh, now I redefine the this uh, finish site remove this uh, ABC. Uh, then this uh, three in S got the expected force. Uh, but if I put that, uh, maybe it's I put ABC, so like actual string, so S is ABC. Now it's if I put it's a three in S, now get that uh, arrow. Uh, but I put this uh, ABC in S, you will also get uh, arrow. Uh, but and let's see. So if I put this uh, finite set, if my site is only uh, A B C A B, just uh, like this, I say T is to all the strings. Uh, let me see A in T is uh, also uh, the wrong. The line is not defined. So a is uh, when I say is uh, simplify, so uh, that is not are uh, allowed. So uh, we will uh, need to uh, restrict for now. Is uh, within a set, you uh, let's uh, deal with the number first. Uh, but as mentioned, is uh, you can install uh, the uh, store the non numbers, I believe, into a set, but that is uh, not a way uh, for this uh, uh, the ease. Uh, to check is uh, AC inside or not. So uh, let's uh, back to S. So S uh, and uh, uh, I will put is uh, uh, the define the S and uh, remove this uh, ABC. Then uh, we can start to see is uh, I don't have uh, five, so five in S. I should get false and four in S. I four. In S, I got true. So at least it's uh, for checking this one is uh, with all number, no matter it's a fraction number, float number, integer number, uh, is uh, okay. So now it's uh, uh, let's uh, clear this uh, finite set. So if I just uh, uh, make T as the, uh, nothing, uh, then uh, it will call the uh, uh, this uh, empty site. So let's say type T. So it's the class is uh, simpy dot size dot size and empty size. Uh, but if I put this S, it's just a finite size. So there's a two type is empty size is our different type. And the creating set is from a list. So uh, let's create our numbers, have our list one, two, three. Uh, and new is the turbo. So we, we can have our finite set uh, from the number, uh, our existing list, but using these uh, asterisk, so members, then let's say S. And T can be the finite set with this uh, star, then from a turbo. And T is another set. So that is also easy. So if we have our existing list, then uh, you can convert that into the sets. Because that is the uh, way is uh, uh, when, for example, uh, when I have a member, uh, like his member, uh, I count is the, like the uh, uh, certain these uh, statistics. Uh, maybe it's I have uh, those three. Three, three, five, six, seven, five, five, one. So I have this uh, big list. When I see numbers, I have uh, more than ten uh, values. But if I just wanted to know how many distinct values, so the less uh, I can use this uh, cardinality uh, and make this uh, uh, finite. Finite side, then put a number inside. So 
then I got is the, the distinct uh, number counts uh, is a total seven. So that is a way so we can uh, make uh, these uh, sets uh, as our uh, tool uh, to help us count the distinct uh, values. Uh, uh, and the creating site is uh, uh, by this either list or tuple. So remember for that. Uh, and that is the approach to create a finite test equivalent to uh, finite site one, two, three. Uh, and then this, uh, let's go to the site repetition or order. Set, sets in Python, like mathematical sites, uh, ignore any repeat of uh, numbers, uh, and they don't keep track of the order uh, of set numbers. So just, uh, you can see from the uh, small to high, but uh, they don't remember that as a real meaning uh, on the ordering. Uh, so if you create a set from a list uh, and that has multiple instances of a number, like what we did here, uh, they remove those uh, distinct. Uh, and uh, we, uh, hence is uh, even though uh, we pass this our list, we had two instances of two, the number two appear only once. In Python list and tuple, each element is stored in a particular order, but the same is not are always true, so uh, we cannot just uh, see this uh, uh, S1, uh, 0 is 1, S1 is 2, so that's not uh, uh, the, the relevant. So now we have uh, uh, S, let's see, so we have S is the finite, so now S looks like it's uh, the 1 to 7, and for members, let's see, in S, print number, yeah, it's uh, like good, so print number, it uh, looks like it's uh, good, but uh, uh, when you run the code, this uh, element could be print in any possible uh, order, uh, even here is uh, uh, looks like it's uh, in default of this uh, uh, order, but uh, you don't have a way to see if so I want to have S1, so that is uh, not here. The set object is not subscriptable, so you, you don't have the index uh, within the sets, so that you need to uh, bear in mind. Uh, let's see the another sample is uh, two sides are equal well, when they have the same, so both S and T have uh, three uh, elements. In Python, you can use uh, equality order. So if I see it's, uh, S is the finite set, three, four, five, and T is finite set, four, four, uh, five, four, three. If you define like this way, uh, but define that as order, uh, so may, maybe I see is uh, A is three four five, B is five four three. Let's see A equal B. Is this correct? False. But S equal same uh, equality to T. That's true. So uh, you compare with uh, this, then uh, you. Uh, you will see the, that is our interesting uh, the result that we will uh, generate. Uh, okay, so uh, that's uh, enough for this uh, uh, video. So I suppose we, we can go to the second part, but let's uh, uh, split is uh, we focus uh, this video is with this uh, site construction and also the background uh, definition of the sites. And in the next video, we talk about the sets uh, relationship uh, each other. So see you in the next video. Bye for now.